Hi, my name is Katherine Rogers, and at the Friedrich Misha Lab of the Max Planck Society, I use zebrafish embryos to study early development. We all started life as a single cell, just like these zebrafish embryos. Somehow, during the process of embryogenesis, a single cell gives rise to many cells that make up different tissue types like skin, heart, and brain. Together, these cells build complex animals that can move, behave, and go on to produce more animals. How does all of this complexity arise from a single cell? We know that a lot of development is controlled by signaling molecules that turn on different genes in different cells, but how exactly this works isn't well understood. We've developed this system that allows me to manipulate signaling in zebrafish embryos using light. This algae makes a protein that can sense blue light. We've hooked the algae protein up to zebrafish proteins that control signaling during embryogenesis. Using this chimeric protein, I can now turn signaling on and off in zebrafish embryos using blue light. Together with my collaborator Mohamed El Gamasi, we created this device that allows us to precisely control light exposure. I can put zebrafish embryos in this dish, then use a Raspberry Pi computer to turn on these blue LEDs, control their intensity, and control how long the lights are on. The zebrafish embryos for these experiments come from our fish facility, where our robot feeds the fish a hearty mix of brine, shrimp, and pellet food four times a day. With the technology that we're developing here, I hope to gain a better understanding of how complex animals arise from single cells.